Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is your guide Olena from Ukraine and in this video I'd like to show you the National Dendrological Park Sofiyevka in the town of Uman. So if you have a trip from Odessa to Kiev or backwards on your rented car or with your friends, yeah, on a personal car, that might be a good idea to come here and to have a walk for one to a couple of hours. Yeah, some people come here especially all the way from the other towns just for the tour because that place is quite interesting. Okay, so that's the main entrance here. Okay, here we have the prices. For adults, it is 100 hryvnas. For kids who go to school, it is 50 hryvnas. Oh, cool! Terrace goes for free. Okay, here we have the place to pay. Dobry day. Okay, here we go. We have three tickets. Terrace wants to drink and he wants to go to the toilet. Okay, so where is the entrance? Here is the entrance. Here we go. The tickets. Okay, as always, people don't want to be on the camera, so I don't film them. Hello. Thank you. Okay, so we go. National Academy of Science of Ukraine, National Dendrological Park, Sofievka. Skatia read that we are not allowed to give food to anyone. Okay, so here we have some reconstruction at the entrance. It is Sunday evening. I don't know how crowded that place was in the afternoon, but right now it, it's almost empty. So the park work, works from 9 a.m. till 7 p.m. After 7 p.m. you can come here for free, so the park doesn't work, which means uh, you don't have to pay, but it is open for public. This is what I was told at the parking lot. Okay, so where do we go? Okay, Katya is our guide today. This girl likes to read a lot, like really a lot. Okay, so here we have the history of that park. Ah, in English, look, historical information. National Dendrological Park Sofievka is a masterpiece of work landscape gardening art of the end of the 18th and the beginning of 19th centuries. So you can see it is quite huge. It is 170 hectares. And let's explore it. Okay, so it's already about 10 minutes that we walk and we can't really understand where we are. There are nothing, no indicators for where to go and uh, like, like there is a map but you can't really understand and uh, people like explain just go forward and you will see something interesting like the locals but we see other people so <laughs> we are not lost we are on the road he said turn left the road will go right and you will see the uh, the way into the forest on the left side so the road goes this way and we were advised to go up here and there is something that we will like. Okay, let's let's have that adventure. I'm tired. Ooh, one more step, one more step. Yes, no indicators. Many people ask each other where to go, where is exit, where is entrance, where is everything. No instructions were given at the entrance, like where you are. No map is given. We Disadvantage. <laughs> Advantage, you have adventure. As always, I say, take it for adventure. Keep, keep, keep. Wow.
The area of the park is almost 170 hectares. It was founded in 1796 by a rich Polish magnate Stanislav Szczęsny Potocki in honor of his beautiful wife Sofia. She was Greek by origin. The park was presented to her on her birthday, 1802. The author of the project of Sofievka, both typographic and architectural, was a talented Polish artillery engineer, Ludwig Metzel. the waterfall wow That is the island. That is a national dendrological park, one of the biggest and the most beautiful in Ukraine. It is situated in the small town of Uman, about 220 kilometers away from Kiev. So it's a very beautiful place. Well, it looks like a beautiful place for a romantic trip, for a family trip, for, for a trip for those people who like nature. And of course, it's your place if you know a lot about the plant trees, because it has more than 3,000 different trees and bushes. The park was founded in the end of 18th century, and since then, it was the center of the gardening in Ukraine. So that is really one of the most beautiful dendrological parks in Ukraine. Thank you. A souvenir marketplace. <laughs> we are so hungry. We're gonna take some hot dogs here. <laughs> Traditional Ukrainian. Yeah, and I have the biggest. <laughs> Are you hungry? Ladies and gentlemen, please don't forget to push the like button and subscribe the channel. It was a pleasure to meet you. Many thanks to my Patreon supporters. Goodbye.